What's up YouTube, this is Seha Man back with another figure review and today we're going to be taking a look at the NECA Aliens. This is the uh, Xenomorph Egg and Face Hugger. You can read it right there, I'll go ahead and uh, zoom in just a little bit. It says uh, Face Hugger Launching Action LED Light Up Glow Effect Push Button Activation. And it says right there, warning 17 and up. Now I got this, this figure for a steal. This one and the uh, the NECA Freddy um, game version, I got both of these figures for a great, great price. Uh, the guy at the comic store that I picked these up from, I, I guess he's a new employee there. He totally gave me the wrong prices for both figures, and I I didn't realize it until I got uh, until I was like driving home and I looked at the receipt. So uh, the, the price I got this for was basically paying for one of the figures. Not even that, it was actually even cheaper than that, but really happy that I got a good deal on these uh, on these figures here. Now, packaging on this, we'll go ahead and uh, um, pick the camera up a little bit. So right here it does read Aliens, and you can see there's the face hugger, and uh, it's your standard NECA Aliens clamshell packaging, which is pretty cool. On the back we have, um, you know, it gives you some instructions on what exactly t you need to do in order to make this work which is pretty cool so that's the that's the back of the packaging right there so what we're gonna do now guys is take a quick break and we're gonna take this outside of the packaging and see how cool this figure really is so stay tuned guys and there you have it guys a quick little 360 look at the uh, alien face hugger and uh, this is just really really cool this is actually the egg but you can see the face hugger that's kind of popping up on the top there and it's it's an LED lighting I'll show you guys this in the dark really quick um, a little bit later but uh, this is pretty much what it looks like from a 360 view I'll do a size comparison uh, comparison as well uh, compared to another NECA figure but okay so this is a little look um, on the on the egg and the face hugger so we're gonna go ahead and take a closer detailed look all right guys so let's see here looking at the egg um here's the bottom right there it does have a little like tab you're supposed to take out here in order to turn this on so you can see at the bottom of it it does have a uh, off and on switch and i'll get into the lighting effect in a second now there is a button right here and when you push this button that's on the side this is gonna this is what's gonna make the uh, face hugger pop out i'll show you guys here so you just push that all, what you got to do is just push this in until you hear the clicking sound and then push that and that's what's going to make the um, the uh, face hugger pop right out. Now I was hoping that this would be maybe this would actually close. It's a softer material here, right here on the flaps that opened up but I was actually hoping this would close up and maybe you can push this in and it'll just pop up. I was also hoping it'd be a little like um, on the kind of wet looking slimy material kind of like in the movie but you know, whatever. It is what it is. It's cool that we have this, and it'll be really nice for, um, uh, you know, display. I'm going to display this next to my DVD setup, so. Uh, getting a close-up on this, though, it's a pretty nice uh, work they put on here in the detailing. And for some reason, I, I always thought this was going to be in the bigger in the bigger scale. I have no idea why I thought it was going to be like a deluxe version, but it still really is nice for what it is. Now, turning on the uh, the battery here, or I'm sorry, the switch, you can see the LED lights. Now, it is pretty bi uh, bright, and it does light up the inside as well. If you push this in, let me see here. You can see that right there. It does light up pretty good. I'm going to turn off one of these uh, lights here. And you can see it is pretty bright, but I'll show you guys what it looks like with all the lights off in a second here. So that's uh, that's what this looks like. Pretty cool. Again, it's like a plastic material mixed with like some soft plastic. So that's really nice. Now looking at the face hugger. Now this guy here is just a uh, soft, rubbery material, but it's really, really nicely uh, detailed. You can get a close look on them. Looks just like the face hugger in the movies. It's got some great detail going on. The paint paintwork on this is pretty good. There's no uh, wire in the you know one of those bendy wires. There's no bendy wires in the tail. Looking on the inside, got that nasty looking, uh, you know, insides you can see in the in the face hugger, which looks pretty sick. But this is very very nice. I mean, NECA does a great job in their figures as it is, so that's really cool. Now, I'm going to show you guys the uh, 
the effect or the little gimmick that you can do to make this thing pop up here. So I already have the inside part pushed in. Just basically, you know, you just pay, place the, uh, the face hugger right in there. Get him right inside. And uh, if you guys want that effect with him lit up, you can see right there, it's pretty cool. It looks pretty good. Jam them in there. Now, and what you do is just pop this up. Just push the button, it's gonna pop right up. It didn't pop up too good, but it just depends on how you place the face hugger. Watch. See if we can get him shooting out. Nope, that one didn't work that time. Okay, so I had to mess with this a little bit. Now, to get this thing to, to pop up, you really have to place him in a certain way to where the tail's bent, like kind of facing the body, and then he actually does pop up pretty good. Let me see if I can zoom out just a little bit more, and then we'll get this to uh, pop up. You can see that he does pop up pretty high, and uh, he landed pretty cool. Now I'm gonna give you a shot, a top view shot of this. Bam, right up there, pretty cool. So it wasn't too completely dark in my room, so I went into the bathroom to show you guys how bright this is. Now this is pretty uh, bright. This is a very, very bright LED. Probably, it looked to me, it looks like it's coming out too bright in the camera, but it actually lights up pretty well, and this will look really cool displayed with uh, your other maybe NECA aliens or Predator figures, but I'm displaying this next to my DVD sets, so this is very, very nice, very bright. Now I don't have any uh, alien figures in hand or any of the Marines, but there's a quick little uh, size uh, comparison with the uh, NECA Predator figure and uh, there's a face hugger right there on the floor so you can see it's uh, it's decent size but for, like I said for some reason I thought this figure was going to be um, a lot bigger. Alright guys so I hope you enjoyed this review. Now this is a pretty cool um, little uh, package set that you get. I mean you get a really nice face hugger which is a rubbery material and again to place this in the egg you got to place him something like this in order him for him to shoot out uh, um, pretty good so just remember that guys now also um, when you're uh, done with this make sure you turn this off otherwise the battery's gonna die on you but the LED light is pretty nice and it's pretty bright so this is a very very cool little accessory to have I'm mean, not accessory but little display piece um, then that's pretty much it guys I hope you enjoyed this review now this is this is hitting I'm not sure if this is gonna be hitting retail stores I'm pretty sure it is though but you can find it for sure at your local comic shops or online. A very nice little um, piece to have. Uh, again, I was hoping for it to be a little bit bigger. And I was actually hoping it, for it to be a little more like on the uh, kind of like a softer side. More of that uh, uh, what, uh, organic look, I guess you can say. like Kind of like in the movies. But you know what? I'm not going to complain. This is still a very nice uh, figure to have. And I don't think we've gotten in uh, a egg sack with a face hugger before at least not in not in my childhood but this is really cool guys hope you guys enjoyed this review this is seha man make sure you guys check out my other videos subscribe if you haven't subscribed hit the like button let me know what you thought about this all right guys thanks for watching take care